What's up, guys? I'm Boo Carlisle. Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Asphalt. Uh, big day today. Cross promoting day is finally here. Landon Huffman driving the Boo Street Stock today at Hickory Motor Speedway. It's about 3:45 in the morning. I don't think I ever been this excited. So uh, a lot of new people gonna be watching this one that uh, watches follows Landon. So uh, we kind of do the same thing over here that Landon does. We just travel a little bit more than Landon does, but. Uh, me and him has been real good friends and uh, helped each other out on, on the whole YouTube thing. So uh, it's going to be awesome to work with him today. I get to be a car owner today. So uh, I enjoy working on him just as much as I do driving. So uh, other than that, thank you for watching. Welcome. Click that like, comment, subscribe button. we both trying to, you know, make short track racing great again. So uh, like I said, about 345 in the morning, we're going to get headed north, hit it 85 on 85. So I hope you all enjoy today. Looking very much forward to it. Hope we can uh, go get us one today. Well, let's head that direction. Try and go get us one. You know how we do it. It might be a little after four in the morning. We're going to grab a gear and get going. Three and a half hours to Hickory Speedway. Ain't much uh, competitors to deal with this morning, but let's grab a gear. 85 on 85. Pulled off here at the quick trip. Feel big wide up here in Greer, South Carolina. $3.25. cents. Y'all people watching California. I know y'all think that's cheap. Get this thing topped off. Keep on boogieing up 85. We've been 85 and on 85 and it's zooming in and out of traffic, making up some good time. Thought we was gonna see a nice sunrise, but uh that didn't happen. So hopefully weather hold off today. Gonna have some weepers at the at the Hickory Speedway, but we finally made it to our exit. I promised Fred a tenderloin biscuit. See if we can't find us one of these old mom and pop joints to fill his uh, need. Well, we tried to get Fred a tenderloin. It was a swing and a miss. Tommy drive-in wasn't open yet, but what think today, Fred? Somebody else driving your race car? Today's the day. Yeah. Excited, thrilled, tickled, yeah. ready to get it over with? Yeah. Which one? Get it over with. Get it. <laughs> Sure he'll do all right. I hope he does better than I. I mean, he'll do uh, he'll do current, he'll do his job. Current track champion. Long as we do our job, we know he'll do his job. Yeah. And we can, if we win tonight, you you gonna break your 21 year streak of not drinking and drink with us? Nah, man. Depends on what you're drinking. We ain't bring no Jack Daniels, so I ain't uh, drinking no nasty ass beer. <laughs> oh, piss water, as you call yeah. it. Y'all can have that. Yeah. All right, well, let's see if we can't find you a little bit of that Tennessee sipping, sir. All right, we'll see what we can work up. Man, I bring you to get a tenderloin biscuit. Promise, I will got to get up 3.30 and leave. What'd you get? Chicken, I don't have tenderloin here. Well, that's all we can find, folks, is Hardy. So he'll smile, eat, and we'll get on to the racetrack about 15 minutes away. Topped off it. We're gonna have to top off on the way back to Georgia tonight. Hickory Motor Speedway is up here somewhere in this uh, thick, dense fog. So hopefully it'll clear out, start to drizzle a little bit. So it's a day race today. Feature race is supposed to start at 4 p.m. So we're hoping to get some morning practice to get landing uh, some seat time in the street stock. I mean, he don't need seat time at Hickory, but you know, it'd be good to get him affiliated with the car. street stock and the car. So uh, we'll see what happens. Fred, where's the racetrack at? I know it's somewhere up here. Right. Well, you know left, right? Your other left? Yeah. Down here somewhere. There it is. Hickory Motor Speedway. Three-eighths mile. NASCAR's famous home track. A good line already forming here. Going to be a full pits today. So uh, $40 to get in for a pit pass today. So pits open 30 minutes. Get your pit pass now. Good line of folks already here. Yeah. Oh, got a pit pass, got a transponder, but this fog hadn't let up, so it ain't look like it's gonna be no morning practice. They're letting haulers pull in now, one per person to each truck. So we'll get this thing pulled in and get us a parking spot. Dreary day, but there's your first look at the 3 8 mile oval of uh, Hickory Motor Speedway. I ain't sure if we're gonna get to park in a good parking or if they're gonna park us on the back stretch. I got somebody directing you where to park. I'm hoping that uh, Landon brought his Prolate model. Moonhead's driving in. I'm hoping we can get parked beside each other. I don't know if they're going to make street stock to park on the back stretch. And we'll figure it out. This man's got all the answers. We next in line. We'll find out. It was a no-go. Go out to park on the back stretch. Landon going to do a little hiking. 
All right, and I planted this joker right here as close to him as I could. So he's built parked right over there. He won't have too far to walk. Hopefully it'll be okay to get parked here. Get this thing unloaded. Well, once Fred and them get to come in, we'll get this thing unloaded. Gonna have a hell of a field here today for the fall brawl. Hopefully this misty rain will move out. Looks like I got plenty of tires today. <laughs> we gotta go back outside. It looks like no morning practice. So let, it, let you park your trailer and then you had to go back out. Go back outside. Headed back outside with the crew. You know, we gotta wait one minute. Fred, what's it gonna look like when they cut us green here in 30 seconds? Cluster. 47 million people gonna run in at one time. Yep. Just to sit and watch the rain. Yep. Just to unload a race car in the rain. Here comes a herd. Hold your arm bands up. We can get the fall broad day started. We might be part of the red. We got us a good spot, Fred. What do you think about it? I think Live Oak Plantation for helping us. Yeah. yeah. Best seat in the house. Landon ain't parked, but about three, four spots over from us. Get this thing unloaded, go get us some tires. We ain't gonna do much of nothing else. Oh, haircut looking fresh. Yeah. Fresh out. This thing unloaded. Got some good help. Got the Race 22 boys here with me today. Young people always looking to learn. They really motivated. Anybody watching this, take chances on young kids. Remember, we was all young at one point, just want to be around race cars. Well, got our tires stacked up. Let's go get us some. You can get four for, I think it's $140. Four scuff tires what Landon will be on today. Big thanks to Maverick Steel Building and GXS right. Hi, boys. Let's go get us some tires. My OG shirt there. Made it over here to the tire line. We about fifth, six in line, so. Be yeah, it ain't nothing going on anyway. We got time to wait, stand around, run for mayor, if you will. Our tire, they mount their tires and wheels now, they right stack. Well, we got them mounted. Good thing about Hickory, they put them on the wheels for you. Anybody watch our video, we spent a lot of time trying to pop these scuff tires on these wheels. So uh, go over here and measure them up, and then stand around and run for mayor. Guy, a corn dog rolled in from the pit wall podcast. Backpack full of beer. Him and Fred gonna beat the hell out of each other. They caught the most junk during the week on the telephone. Early morning practice done snuck up on us. They're gonna give us 10 minutes, so we're rushing down to get landing his first laps in the street stop. Hopefully, it's a go good.
Hey, man, that looked good. Might turn this damn helmet all the way around on my head <laughs> if I wanted one. Uh, Landon wearing my helmet when radio plugs didn't line up just right. I know y'all seeing that GoPro, the helmet's like this. <laughs> I'm gonna have to tie my nappy ass hair back too. Damn, that's fun. Oh, yeah, definitely different. I mean, it's close. Yeah. No, you don't. I think this country's different. The rest of them, I mean, I see you saw it on the wheel. Yeah, you know, well, the, We get one more practice. We got a left front that uh, Diffuse sent us with dynamic shocks. Wants to try some different stuff, so make a quick shock change and uh, got one more practice. See if he likes that any better. Have a race monitor working here but from what our you know time clock showed uh, landon was he runs a 51 was his fastest lap that we clocked and uh, gary ledbetter the hero of the street stocks in the carolinas he run a 35 so or that's what you know they told us they run a 35 so we ain't too far off but up next qualifying get one lap uh pull out come to the green check it the next time ain't no dead laugh ain't no two laps you better be ready to go so let's get rolled over there hopefully we put this joker on the stop Five three, Jesse Clark on sixteen twenty. We're sitting third right now. I don't know if I'm overcompensating, overcompensating, trying to like get as much as I can out of it, thinking that it's going to be kind of like dead in the water, sort of. Yeah. Or if I'm just not, uh, it's not what I need to be. Like I said, I'm taking the race. Second lap. 
Yeah, it didn't look better, but usually, like I said, you come to green and just check her. But we'll be fine. I just, yeah, oh, yeah, we'll be 35 lives. 35 30, lives. 30. Talking with Landon, uh, the shock chains made it real tight, so we're going to put the other shock back on for the 30 lap race here coming up soon. Get your air pressure set for a 30 lap race. All right, Landon, we starting fourth, man. You're getting better every time. More laps and more laps. You're gonna make this high side work here in a second when they drop the green. I think I'm gonna be in better shape once I get around people. I'm, uh, it's a different world. I'm having fun. Appreciate the opportunity to come do it. We're having a lot of fun with the video stuff and I think it's gonna be cool for you guys to watch. A little bit of a crossover, but Thank you to Boo and his family for giving me the, the uh, chance to come have some fun in street stock. I think we're better than we qualified. I'm just still learning. Haven't really been around anybody yet. So. Well, your helmet don't fit too good either. Also, also I feel like a bobblehead out there. So that's a little on me. I should have figured out my radio plug. But regardless, I'm going to drive the shit out of it. We're going to have a good time. And, uh, we're we're going to drink beer in Victory after. Lane. Yeah. Well, even Tex said Victory Lane. Well, whichever. we'll drink beer regardless. Yeah. We're going to win the damn race, too. Getting ready to strap in for 30 laps. Track champion. See if we can get it done in the street stop. Not a haircut, a hair bow. Did I find ponytail? GoPros are on. Get it done, Landon. Outside of row number two, rolling off in the fourth position, driving the Boo Carlisle Double Zero. It's Hickory Motor Speedway late model track champion, Landon Huffman. How about Landon Huffman, 2022 track champion? He went on a quest to get his name on the wall with his dad to be forever there. Uh, he achieved that, so we'll see what he can do in the B-double-O tonight. That's pretty exciting. Absolutely it is. It, it's rare you see a track champion step back, or if you do see him step back, they go into the limited late model division, sometimes the trucks like Charlie Watson. But uh, him and Boo, uh, very good friends through social media and uh, podcasting and stuff, and somehow he landed in the ride of Boo Carlisle, and it's going to be fun to watch Landon. Uh, I, I think they got more stuff of brewing. Just keep up with those guys. Oh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> now, is this one of those deals? It's like you let me drive your car, you can drive mine? <laughs> right, yeah. yeah. We want to see Boo I in the see late model. Boo in the 75. That's right. <laughs> All right, Landon, I'm finally with you. Go get mail, brother. Thanks for the opportunity, my dude. Appreciate it. That's the fun. Gas to here to get a better start. You can ride the brake and give it gas, you know, if you think you can turn it up. Guys are doubling up here. Oh, that's 
start landing. Do you, uh, do you feel good with shifting? Yeah, the 12 car didn't go like I thought he should. I laid back a little because he was laying off of the five. Never really gets going any time I've ever raced with him as far as on start. So I pushed him down the straightaway before, but it just puts, it in, puts you in such a bad situation. Like, I thought I would be harder on the restarts, but he was like real bogged down versus what mine felt like. It didn't want to roll around the top down there one and two quick. It does good to get right in the middle and then it picks up a shove, but it might get better as the tires come up. It turns really good on the throttle. If I could just get to the throttle sooner, I think I could make the damn thing get around the corner. And is that windshield kind of like a Cadillac compared to that late model right now? Looks like I'm strolling down I-95 with the hell just clear. What the hell's a pot, right? Yeah, I'm about to say it. 
man at Hickory Motor Speedway tonight, Landon Huffman, yeah. finished fourth in the street stock race. What did you think overall? I had fun, man. I I felt like I learned the whole time. I felt like we were fighting a little snug. I tried to move around. I think I tried every damn groove on this racetrack. Uh, I actually thought at the end, I went and looked at race monitor, and we were as good as the couple in front of me there at the end once I figured out moving around. But it Just was needed fun. a caution. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. I think that was the first time I'd driven one of them cars here. Thank you to Boo for giving me an opportunity. Um, hopefully we do it again. Hey, oh, we're going to go Tri-County and do it next time. Yeah, Tri-County be a little... We'll go somewhere where I'm, I'm a little less known, you know? Yeah, exactly right. Yeah, a yeah, sneaker. a little bit, a little bit more welcome there for this opportunity. I had a good time. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoy the video and support, support my man Boo. I really appreciate everyone that tunes into what we do at a short track level. It's growing, and uh, we got to keep, keep the train moving. Both of us going to Florence next week. Me on both Friday, you on Saturday. Yeah, both going to Florence. We'll have videos. Both of us will. Uh, we're both going to Pockets and Brews to drink beverages tonight. So that's going to be a lot of fun as well. Oh, right, well, that's going to wrap up our fun time here at the Hickory Motor Speedway. We're going to head this train back to Jefferson tonight, about three and a half hours. So uh, great time with landing today. Great cross promotion Ooh. of uh, YouTube stuff. Reg, you have a good time today? Yep. A little chilly, a little cold, but uh, we'll be at Florence Motor Speedway. This coming Friday for a 50 lap street stock race. And that's gonna end our year at Florence on Saturday. So, uh, or no, I'm sorry, Saturday, Friday evening. It'll be on uh, Flow Racing. It's uh, supposed to be like a 5 p.m. start. 50 lap, 2,000 to win. So we're gonna point this train south. Thank y'all very much for watching. Thank you to all the new people from Landon's uh, side of town that's watching. Y'all hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. We're greatly appreciate it. But other than that, Again, y'all know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Take care.